Hello there, in this video I'm going to show you a pretty handy tool that I have designed for Excel. This tool basically will save you a lot of time when working with the sheets in your Excel files. Most Excel users run into a problem at the moment of searching through a workbook for a specific sheet, especially when that workbook contains a lot of sheets. Imagine that you have an Excel file in front of you with 30 or 50 sheets. The process of finding the specific sheet you need can be tricky. So, let me show you how does it work. Once you have installed mini tools for worksheets admin, you will see this new group of options up here in the ribbon. First, let's see how you can switch between sheets using the browser. As you can see, there is a browser button and clicking on that button will open the navigation panel. So here in the panel, the first thing you will see is a vertical list of all the sheets in the workbook. You can go to any sheet you want just clicking on its name. And this is a real-time list, which means that any change in your sheets will appear instantly on the list. And by change I mean, for example, when you add, delete, rename, or move a sheet. Let me show you. I'm going to add some sheets. Now let's rename this sheet. Let's delete it. And now let's move this one. Down here on the bottom of the browser you will see three buttons through which you can add, rename or delete sheets. For example, if I want to add a new sheet between sheet 31 and sheet 32, I just need to click on sheet 31 and click on the add button, enter the name of the new sheet, enter and that's all. And now I can rename the sheet. and delete it. And up above the sheet list there is a search box where you can type the name of the sheet you are looking for. As you can see, as I type the browser selects automatically the sheet that most closely matches the search criteria. To disable the browser just click again on the browser button. Now I'm going to show you the Sheets Manager that will let you rearrange the Sheets order as you want in a very easy way and massively rename all the Sheets you want just with one click. To open the Manager, click on the Manager button and in the first tab you can rearrange the Sheets order. The first list shows you the current order of your Sheets as a reference to set up a new order here in the second list. You can move your Sheets up and down through these buttons or you can just simply use the automatic alphabetical order from A to Z or from Z to A. In this case I'm gonna use the automatic order from A to Z. To sum up, this is the current order of your sheets and after clicking on the OK button your sheets will be sorted according to this list. So let's click on OK button and as you can see all the sheets have been sorted alphabetically from A to Z. Now let me show you how you can massively rename sheets in your workbook. First click on the manager button and now I'm going to select the second tab, rename. Here you will see two vertical lists. The first shows you the current name of all the sheets and you can modify that names in the second list. To start I'm going to press the tab key and write the new name to the first sheet. Click again tab to jump to the next sheet, write a new name 
and so on. Okay, once you have renamed all the sheets you want, just click on the OK button and that's all. All the sheets have been renamed. With the Gather Sheets feature, you can merge several Excel workbooks into a single one. In order to show you how does it work, I have prepared a short example using these three Excel workbooks. Let me show you one by one these files. The first, A1, contains two worksheets. The second, A2, contains also two worksheets. And the last one belongs to an older format, Excel 97 to 2003, but that is not a problem. Okay. This file contains just one sheet. Now let's suppose that I want to add these three workbooks to this new workbook. Okay, first click on the Gather Sheets button and now I have to select where I want to add all the workbooks. For example, if I want to add all the workbooks sheet by sheet between the sheet 2 and the sheet 3, I can choose the criteria before and then select the sheet 3. Or I can choose the criteria after and then select the sheet 2. The result will be the same. OK, now click on Next button. Now I have to select all the files A1, A2, and A3. Click on the Open button, and that's all. All the workbooks have been added sheet by sheet between the sheet 2 and the sheet 3 of this workbook. To show you that, I'm going to open the browser and here you can see the name of each workbook followed by hyphen the name of each sheet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 sheets have been added in a completely automated way. Have you ever wanted to flip back and forward between two sheets in a workbook? Let's say that I want to work with two sheets, sheet A and sheet B. And frequently I need to copy data from sheet A to sheet B. So typically what I have to do is select the sheet A, copy the information that I need, then go back to the sheet B and paste that information in. And then I need to go back to the sheet A, once again copy the information that I need and go back to the sheet B and paste that information in. Well, the last feature I want to show you is called Jump, which basically lets you jump between two sheets. Let's see how it works. First I select sheet A and then I select the sheet B. And now, when I click on the jump button, that basically takes me back to the last sheet I was working on. So, this way is a lot easier and faster to work between two sheets. Now I can copy the information that I need and paste it here, and then go back and copy, go back and paste.